although for demonstration purposes in this film, we are running the installations in the factory. The procedure on the building site is identical with what is shown here. You will need a core drill with clamping strap and cooling water feed. The saddle, if required, with a sealing cap, a tool to tighten the nuts, lubricant, an expansion resin and a cartridge gun with a special distance piece. The procedure. Position the core drill on the pipe. At first the strap is only tensioned a little. This allows the unit to be positioned exactly. The drill calyx must be selected to give a bore of 200 mm diameter. If the calyx bit is very worn down, it should be renewed, as a hole that is a few millimeters too small makes it difficult to fit the saddle. It only takes a short time to produce the hole. Remove the drilling sludge and any burrs. Check the success of the work by hand. Now smear the elastomer seal with lubricant. Pushing the saddle into the opening will now give no problems if you have observed the previous instructions. Push the moulding into the bore so that it can be loosely pushed backwards and forwards. If you cannot achieve this state immediately, simply screw the nut upwards a little by turning it anti-clockwise. Reseat the saddle loosely. The next operation follows. Tightening the nut, now in the clockwise direction. While doing so, check the seat of the seal again by hand. Continue to turn the nut, pressing the internal sealing ring lightly onto the wall of the pipe. Do not use the tool until it is no longer possible to move the nut by hand. With increasing force, the sealing ring will be pressed against the wall, providing an inner seal. Check for the last time that the saddle is seated correctly. The moulded component is now given an additional external seal using expansion resin, which is pressed into a special hole from outside. The cartridge contains the precise quantity of resin necessary for filling the cavity that still remains. The distance piece must always be fitted to the cartridge gun. Its special construction ensures that the resin components, kept separately in the cartridge, are bought together at the correct mixing ratio when being pressed out. Thus, one complete cartridge of the appropriate size is to be used for each saddle and to be completely squeezed empty. The subsequent expansion of the resin will now completely fill the remaining cavity after a short time. The outer sign of this is the escape of resin around the edge of the moulded component. If the connection pipes are not being fitted immediately, a sealing cap with a sealing ring is screwed firmly on. The time-consuming job of wedging the plate against the trench wall, previously necessary for leakage tests by pressurising the sewer, can be done away with. As you have seen, the whole of the work can be carried out in only a few minutes by a single employee. The low installation costs, stable seating and long-lasting seal associated with this have led to more and more users using the saddle not only on fabricant pipes but also on other types of pipe.